In this video, we will explore how to define a custom 404 page using the new app router. By default, in any Nexus application, when you navigate to a route that is not defined in the app folder, Nexus renders a default 404 not found page. For example, when you access localhost 3000 slash billing, which is a route we don't have in our application, we see the default 404 page. While this default page is useful for quick prototyping, you might often want to customize its appearance. To create a custom not found page, simply create a file named not-found.tsx or not-found.js if you're using JavaScript in the app folder. Let's head back to VS Code and create the file. Within the app folder, create a new file named not-found Dot .tsx. The file name has to be not hyphen found. Inside this file, define and export a React component. Let's call the component not found, and we will return a div tag with an h2 that says page not found, and a paragraph tag could not find requested resource. The structure and styling of this component is totally up to you. Our focus in this video is on the concept and not styling. So create the not-found.tsx file and export the component as default. If we now head back to the browser, we would see the text from our custom not found page. In most production applications, it is desirable to display a custom 404 page with branding and theme styling applied. This is how you can achieve it. It is worth noticing that this not found page is tied to the file-based routing mechanism of the app router. But what if we want to programmatically render this page based on a certain condition? For that purpose, we can use the not found function from Next.js. Let me show you how it works. Let's assume that the number of reviews for a product cannot exceed 1000, and we want to display a not found page for a review ID greater than 1000. So in page.tsx file within the review ID folder, start by importing the not found function from next slash navigation. Then within the component, if parse int of params dot review ID is greater than 1000, we invoke the not found function. While we are at it, it's also worth mentioning that not found pages can also be defined at the folder level. So within the review ID folder, create a new not found dot tsx file with the following content. A component called not found that displays the text review not found. Now, back in the browser, if we navigate to localhost 3000 slash products slash 100 slash reviews slash 5, we should see the expected output. But if we navigate to reviews slash 1001, we will see the review not found page. This page corresponds to the file within the review ID folder and not the one present in the app folder. Hopefully, the hierarchy is clear to you. Well, that covers the not found file and the function introduced in the new app router. Thank you for watching. And if you're enjoying the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. I'll see you in the next one.